All right, we are attacking the basement. Can you, do, can, you, can you get them off of me? I'm trying to do a push. -up. Well, we need to put them outside then, honey. Okay, you guys, welcome to the vlog. We are um, doing push ups. Okay. <laughs> get off me, Nugget. We are decluttering this basement, which is overdue for months. Right? Yes. We um, have basically different piles. One will be like DI, trash. This is an extra bucket. Okay, good. We'll need that bucket. The reason why this basement looks this way is because when we recarpeted the bedrooms upstairs, a lot of stuff that we weren't sure about or didn't want, or even if we wanted it, came down here Rocky. to the basement. Rocky. <whistles> Rocky, come here. Oliver's trying to do a little, have a little break and take some, do some push-ups. But a lot of it is Marla and Amanda stuff. So we are, and we've ordered, Amanda, let me show you. See this right here? That box? That's a treadmill. We've had this for like four months and we are going to put it up. Well, he's going to put it up. Let's be honest. Let's be honest with this. That hurt. <laughs> My battery light is flashing. Hey, can you call him please? Rafi! Rafi! I think we should just put them outside. Yay! Okay, so let me pan in on the basement here. This is what's going on. We not so much want to rearrange it as we want to declutter it. So we're trying to figure out where all this is going, our workout area, the girls filming area, Oliver's office area. We need to figure out where we're putting the treadmill though. We're not quite sure. But I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like right now. We've got a lot of work in front of us. It's spring break, guys. Quarantine, spring break, nothing else to do but clean our basement so right now this is stuff that needs to go back upstairs oh, wow. Ralphie I think we've left you long, down here long enough Ralphie your days down here are over so I just also want to show you guys so we want to keep this as the filming area I think what we'll do is try to put the lamps up against the wall for now Marla well right now I'm just kind of condensing stuff that can be condensed yeah and I think I'm gonna get rid of the chair right there So we're trying to figure out how we want to lay everything out, if we might change the studio area. So I'll be right back. Okay, it's looking like we are actually going to move around the furniture after all. We decided to take this workout area and put it over there where the couch is. And then where the couch is, we'll go right in front of this window where the workout stuff is. Actually, I forget, where's the filming area going? The filming area is staying right there. Oh, okay, it's gonna stay here. Okay, it's gonna stay here. See if I can get you guys a better overview. Here in the corner is their filming area. Here is the workout area, which is going to be swapped out for where the couch is. And then we will put a TV above where that white table is. So this might take a day or two to show you guys the entire process of our basement makeover. So that green chair over there, guys, we've had that every single child. We've rocked them in that. We have rocked you guys in that green chair to sleep when you were babies. Like, like we've rocked the viewers. We would rock the viewers there. No, but seriously, dad, so my husband is sentimental about that chair. I am, but I'm, I'm ready to say goodbye to it. How about you? I don't care. You should care. You should have an opinion. Okay, Lazy Bones, get up. Do you need some help? Do you want dad to help you? Well, it pull, it slides right out. You pull up on the back part. You got it. Oh, uh, that's like the best feeling. Can you guys shred something? Bye, chair. Bye, chair. You've been good to us. Uh, that's kind of sad. I know, Dad does not want to get rid of it, but he's agreed to it. You want to carry the rest? No. I've never known that. Wait, it's already so much better than her. Okay, let's just put it right there for now. Marla likes telling people what to do. This is the one for me.
Okay, that area is coming along really good. Marlon's vacuuming. Amanda fixed the pillows to the couch right here. And then the couch faces this wall. All this will get moved and a TV will go up here. We're debating on selling that one and just getting a different TV that's a little bit bigger for right here and we'll wall mount it. Okay, they're coming down now with the TV. Put it up. Ralphie and Amanda are just chilling right now while Oliver's putting in the wall mount. He's measuring everything. Okay, sweetheart, what's next? We can install this guy here, up here somewhere behind the TV. We can have the power we need without having the cords dangle down. Is she playing with you? I got this formation here. What I'm what I'm gonna do is drill a hole through both of those studs. We should fit both of the wires we need to put in there, no problem. Okay guys, it's the next day. Um, it's actually evening time. Oliver's off work and he's taking time to work on putting up the TV. We ran into a problem with, because we want the cord to be behind the wall because there was the studs there like he explained last night he had to cut some holes into the wall so we got to fix this so what i've done here is the first coat dried and so before sanding i tape this down so it doesn't make a mess on the carpet the baseboard or the electrical stuff i have there then i sanded and then i put a second coat of plaster to, to help fill in the gaps and whatnot and then afterwards i'll sand it again a second time and then i'll spray some texture and we'll paint and, and then paint and, and then the tv up and, and no and, cord and, and then mama's happy yeah so all of this was so that we don't see a cord hanging down but right now you see these cords but the tv will go over that and you'll see nothing you'll just see one. that will be nice but yeah this is coming along once again once this is done then we can pretty much put the rest of the living room back together and I ordered some new pillowcase covers for oh, nice. the red ones. Oh, whoops. I, didn't, I thought we had two and two. I need to get one more for the red one. Okay. Well, thanks for all you're doing. We'll come back and show them uh, what it looks like when it's all painted. Yeah. And so I'll try to sand that tonight if it dries quick enough. And then I'll sand it and texture it tonight and tomorrow we can paint. Sounds good. Do you guys hear Marla upstairs? Howling. <laughs> <laughs> Love you. Okay, I ordered some pillowcases for the couch down here because, hey, Ralphie's following me down. Oliver's working right now, but I'll make this quick. I have these colored pillowcases that I wanted more neutral colors, but I got these two white ones. I got them from Amazon, and then I got these white, like, plush See how soft? Oh, I'm so excited. So I'll put those on right now. I took off the red and the floral pillowcases and now I just have these neutral colors on the couch. I think it looks pretty good. It just gives it a cleaner look, I think. Anyway, I really like the way it turned out. Okay, the texture spray is pretty dry, ready to paint. We just put some plastic down. Okay, we just got the TV hung. We still have to get some cords for it. Marla, you wanna see the TV? Wow. Oh, if it's any bigger. <laughs> if it's any bigger, that ceiling. And it barely turns. <laughs> okay, we just got the treadmill all put together. I'm sorry, Oliver got the treadmill all put together. And I love where it's at. How are you guys feeling about the spot? Yeah, what, four months later we finally got it. <laughs> I know, <laughs> it's so awesome excited. though. And then we got Ralphie and Marla right here. Yeah, so let's not get rid of this chair. This is a nice chair. I know, but it's a matter of like where are we gonna put it. We don't. 
Just keep it right there. It's fine. In front of your filming area? No, right here. Right, right with my, right in this hallway. Keep it right in the hallway. Okay, we could do that. Okay, guys, we are done with the basement. I want to show you. I'm so excited. It definitely was a team effort. Thanks to my husband and my kids helping out. So it isn't a big change, but we rearranged some furniture. We added a TV, and I love the way it turned out. It's way more functional, so I'll show you guys. So coming down the stairs into the basement is my husband's office area. Okay, and here's the rocking chair. We decided to keep the brown one. We got rid of the green one. Kept the filming area over here for my girls. And then over here is the couch that it used to be over there and so we moved it from there to right here I love it right here and then it faces the TV I'm not sure if we're gonna keep the console but for now it works and I love the size TV we got I think it's perfect for this size room and then where the couch used to be we now have all our workout equipment and we finally got up the treadmill yay I'm so excited okay and just from this angle showing you guys the treadmill and the workout equipment and we have this rowing machine here some kettleballs and we have this weight bar here and my son has that around there. Did you come for a visit? Did you come to visit? Oh, he's so cute. Okay guys, I'm gonna go ahead and close this vlog, this basement makeover vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed the process and we'll see you next time. Okay, bye. Okay, hey, Ralphie, let's go up, we're done. Come on, let's go upstairs. <laughs>